perpetual winners Patriot are back for Camper Trailer of the Year, powered by Red Arc. Now last year, they did exceptionally well, winning best build quality. Now the X3, that's back, has had a few updates. Let's check with the judges to see if it can take out the top gong. Perennial winners, Patriot, back again, this time with the MY22, so the 2022 version of the X3, which is the same model we saw last year, but this one with incremental changes. Now we will know who Patriot is, you know, arguably the leaders of the pack when it comes to camper trailers. X3 is a bit of a departure from what they used to do, so who's the target audience and what are they going to do with it? Well, Patriot campers are renowned for making uh, campers that are unstoppable, and the X3 is certainly no different, except it's got added luxury, and that's certainly aimed at uh, couples with no kids. Added comfort, you can still get in there, sit down, uh, there's not some nice table there to sit on. If the grandkids do come, you can fold it down to have a little uh, nook for them to sleep in. But yeah, when it comes to uh, comfort, the X3 has definitely got that. You mentioned um, grandkids, so this is probably a Patriot targeted empty nesters or a younger couple who just wants a bit more comfort than the traditional rooftop style tent that a lot of the smaller Patriots have on them. Uh, in terms of quality, it's pretty hard to beat a Patriot. There's just a real care and a real passion. Like the quality control there is outstanding. So, Kat, you know, once you start that process of setting it up, how easy is it? And is it a comfortable camper? A Patriot builds campers for people who like camping. It's quite likely it could be quite unpleasant standing outside if it's absolutely teeming down with rain, but you have a haven to retreat to. And I think that's what Patriot is trying to provide. I mean, you get little features like the coffee tower inside. You've got that beautiful Dometic stove. Regardless of what's going on outside, there's a little bit of luxury to remind you that you're still on holiday. Absolutely, and setting it up wasn't too hard? Setting it up is a dream, it always has been with it. That sort of lifting that, that lid over, it's light as the whole thing just unfurls in one go. And I think the guys had it set up in probably about three or four minutes. Patriots always commanded a price premium, and I think that you know that's reflected in the quality. But do you think it's good value for money, this X3? The camper is phenomenal, there's nothing else like it. It's a really unique beast. It's, I kind of look at it like it's a 79 series. Underneath is just absolutely rock solid. It's got an amazing drivetrain. That's where the money goes. Everything else just kind of fits in where it can. So when you look at the, the chassis though, when you look at the details, when you look at where you can take it, that's what you're paying for. If you're gonna go and bounce it down gunshot, you probably don't really have much of a choice with another camper, so. It's very subjective on the use. I think you've um, nailed it with the analogy of a 79 series. It is utilitarian. I don't think it's bad value for money. I think you get what you pay for. The pedigree and the reliability of that brand say a lot, and I think, I think that adds a lot of value. Um, what did you think was innovative about the X3? The Ridgelite chassis uh, keeps the camper strong, but it also keeps it light. Uh, the aluminium body joins the chassis for a monocoque design, and if in an accident, uh, the modulated system allows the damaged section of the body to be removed and easily replaced. The XO rack mounting system also offers an integrated solar panel, uh, which while you're driving it stays on top and then when you, you camp you pull it off and then you've got a portable solar panel. I thought in terms of self-sufficiency it doesn't offer you the world of power and the world of water because it is quite a, a, a camper set up to just keep moving, keep exploring. But I did really appreciate the hot water system that can also be used as an internal heater. So if it's a cold morning, fire it up, get comfortable. Same with the Dometic cooktop outside has a crazy 20,000 BTU. It'll get your potatoes hot pretty quick. Obviously, like all, all Patriots, fitted with Red Arc, the um, TVMS, um, which is super easy to monitor what's coming in from a power point of view and what's going out. They still use deep cycle batteries. Like for the extra, call it 1,200, 1,500 bucks to go to lithium in that camper, you're only saving 20 kilos. One of the things I do really like about the um, X3 is the 2,000 liters of storage. Like it does have a decent payload at 550 kilos. Not all of that's chewed up by the water because the water capacity is not massive, which means you do still have quite a lot of room there to add a lot of gear of your own. What about its X Factor, Dan? Oh, mate, X Factor, it's, it's like off-road ability with Patriot. If you see a convoy of lifted 79s heading to the outback with Patriots behind them, you know they're gonna go drive the toughest tracks. It's just, it's part of the image, it's part of the brand. It's probably part of the 80 grand. There's nothing like it. And Kath, um, in terms of off-road ability, we towed that one with an Isuzu. So with a more everyday vehicle, how did you find it from a towing point of view? It was a real relief actually to pull it with an Isuzu because the, the previous years where we've taken it out with a Ram, 
you've hardly known it was there. It, it could have been anything. So this gave us a, a lot better impression as to, to the towability and the off-road ability. Patriot is just renowned as a market leader in off-road ad adventure campers. I mean, it's, it's, it's agile because it's small, it's you know tiny dimensions, it's got a, a whopping great departure angle, it's tonka tough to construction, it's got the, you know, the Cruise Master X Cruise suspension that we see every year. And that integration with that hot dip rigid light chassis with those um, aluminium outriggers, uh, it's, it's got the goods. We know it and we've said that, that's why you pay the price. That's the Patriot X3 MY22 at Camper Trailer of the Year 2022, sponsored by the power of Redark. If you enjoyed that video, please like and subscribe. And if you want to watch more from this year's shootout, we have 10 more camper videos in our channel below.